Hey there, gang. Um, this is Rob. Um, every day you wake up and you make a choice. Am I going to get out of bed and take on my day? Or am I going to lay in bed and whine about it? Uh, today was a great day for me. Um, I can't wait to show you this video. But let's start it with this really sweet intro that we got yesterday. Kick it. All right, here we go. Um, welcome back. We are headed to the Y. I'm actually in the parking lot of the Joplin Y right now. Um, today is my cool down uh, rest day. Um, I gotta get a 20 minute walk in. Um, but one thing that I'm gonna do here today is I'm going to use this machine that uh, basically reads all the fat contents, all these weird things in your body. I'm not even 100% sure what it does. Uh, I tried to use this machine about a month and a half ago, and when I went to use it, it basically said, sorry, you're too fat, um, weight limit is 440 pounds, and I was about 450, 455, something like that when I used it, so uh, that was deflating. Um, I was actually right in the middle of the gym, they, they put it right in the middle of the place, and here's this big dude trying to use a machine that basically just said, nope, sorry, you're too fat. Um, so I'm going to give it another try. Uh, my scale reading in the morning at you know 5 a.m. after a fast, I haven't eaten anything right in the morning, um, read 4.33 today. Um, plus, I'm not exactly going to go walking into the gym wearing the birthday suit, how I weigh in the morning. So between clothes and lunch, I'm really, really hoping I'm below the 4.40 mark. Because uh, honestly, if I step on that thing and it says that I'm too fat again, that's going to be a downer. So uh, I know I'm not supposed to look at weight. I'm not supposed to look at all these uh, things just as numbers. But, uh, yeah, they're important to me. So uh, I know I'm feeling better. I know I'm feeling strong. I would really like to be able to make this a small accomplishment. So uh, I'm going to go in there. Uh, I'm going to go for a little walk, and then we're going to measure up, and I'm going to see uh, what I can do. Uh, I don't know if I can get it on the video or not, um, but I'm going to see what I can do. So uh, here we go. Alright, here goes nothing. Drop them wide. Okay. Yeah, man, it's just finished two miles. Two miles. Two frick miles. Less than 35 minutes. 35 minutes. Jerome, you're a friggin' genius. 30 seconds on, three minutes off. Over and over again. I think that's nine or ten sets. Oh, yeah. Time. All right, everybody, I, uh, I'm back. I uh, just got back in the truck from a pretty uh, sweet little run. Um, when I first started this thing about two weeks ago, I'd go for about a half a mile walk, really man up and do a mile, and I'd be sweating. I was doing about 22, 23 minute mile. And uh, man, I'm just two weeks in, and uh, I just broke 35 minutes for uh or was it 36 35 or 36 minutes 35 something for uh two miles um i feel awesome um that, that's a huge huge deal for me that's that's cutting uh man 15 20 minutes off my 5k time uh just went 30 seconds jogging uh three minutes running or uh, walking and yeah i just kept going that i have my interval timer uh drum recommended for me and uh, man, I feel great, but uh, I wanna show you one thing. Um, I told you I was a little worried about that machine. Um, last time I stepped on that machine, I was over 440. I think I said this in the last video, but uh, like I was like 450 pounds and I stepped on the machine and it basically said, you're too fat, get off me. Try again when you're not so fat. So uh, yeah, I go back in there and uh, you're supposed to get this printout of what you can do and uh, yeah, baby, right here. What that is, is this is my readouts. I don't know what they say. I don't really know what they mean. Uh, drum's gonna break that down for me, but uh, heck yeah, man, it spit it out. I had about eight or nine pounds to spare. Uh, so yeah, that's a big step for me. Um, today it's a, a weight machine. 
tomorrow it might be a scale. One day it's going to be a roller coaster that I can get back on. Um, yeah, I spent 40 years blowing up and I'm over the hill now and the ride downhill is going to be way better. Uh, losing weight, uh, eating right, and feeling energized. So if you think it's too late, man, don't don't think it's too late. If uh, you don't feel motivated to do, do something, don't go try to run two miles. Go walk around the block. Go, uh, I don't know, instead of eating four pieces of chicken, eat three pieces of chicken. Um, we're having pizza for dinner tonight. Um, we're having my kids over, and they're all their girlfriends and boyfriends and all that, which means I'm going to have about 500 people in my house, so we're not going to do what we planned on. Uh, so we're going to have pizza. And you know what? I'm having pizza. And you know how many I'm going to have? Two. Maybe three. If they're thin crust, I'm going to count up my calories and be smart. And then I'm going to go out tomorrow morning, and I'm going to dominate my day. So, uh, yeah, guys, take care of your own business. Um, as I said earlier, manage your time. Balance your day between hard work and studies or exercise or the hobbies, whatever you do, but make sure you make time for yourself. So if you don't make time for yourself, you're no good for nobody. And it's about time I'm good for my family and my friends and my church and all you guys. So uh, hang tight. And if you're new to this channel, I'm only about five, six videos into this. But about a year from now, two years from now, you ain't going to recognize this big dude. This is going to be the video that I go back to in two years and say, man, that was the day that he broke that two-mile mark. And that's the day he realized that he really is going to be something special. So uh, we're all something special in the name of the Lord and the Father. So do what you're doing. I'll do what I'm doing. And I will see you next time.